let's hop into the market, right? Let's hop into the market. Let's look at the market's doing. Let's see what, you know, market cap's sitting at. Let's see what everything's sitting at right now. Um, we're still sitting just like Tuesday, sitting at that 2.2 trillion mark. Um, I think we almost hit three um, on the last bull, on the last bull run. Um, but this is this has never been as high. So, you know, coming into um, 2022, I think, you know, we're going to see a lot of these prices not be there. Um, but it could happen quick. It could happen quick. And then we go into a bear run, right? Now, if you go look at Bitcoin, Bitcoin works in cycles. You guys know there's like a two, maybe three year span where, you know, the market is just going down, which is okay, right? But if you, you know, you saw the opportunities with NFTs, you saw the opportunities with the staking, right? You saw the opportunities with the lending platforms that we've given you guys. We've given you so much stuff. It's not just, just because crypto is going down, that doesn't mean we can't make money. There's going to be games that you're going to be able to earn Ethereum and, you know, the kart racing game and, and stuff like that. You're going to be able to earn tokens while playing these games. So while the market's going down, there's going to be more opportunities opened up to create even more income. So, you know, pay attention these next, I would say next two months, um, we're going to be really, really, really pinnacle um, to, you know, capitalizing on profits. Um, you know, just stay tuned. It could happen slower. It could happen over a year span. I don't know, right? We don't know. We're just reacting, right? But Bitcoin sitting around that 47, between that 47 and $50,000 range. Um, like I said before, um, if we're looking at a Bitcoin chart, I really want to see Bitcoin crack above 52 all right. If it cracks above our 52 range, I think we'll be back in our in our in our element to, you know, going back into the bullish market that we were in. Um, but it's going to be it's going to be over a period of time. So don't think it's going to happen overnight. Be patient. You know, if you have some bags, like I told you before, I'm being patient. I'm waiting. And then once Bitcoin gives me that sign of reversal, that that movement above 52, that's when I'm going to start getting into um, you know, the gaming cryptos, right? It's usually like a week or two um, lag behind. So once Bitcoin pumps, I would say maybe about a week later, you'll see gaming cryptos, you see metaverse cryptos follow, right? You'll have a little bit of lag, it could be even a couple of days, but I'm, we're going to keep you guys tuned in. I've been really, really studying up on gaming cryptos and there's the movement compared to Bitcoin, looking into the technology, look into the games, look how far they've developed. And in these next couple of weeks, guys, you guys got to be on your toes. I'm going to be pumping out some gaming cryptos like this almost every single day or maybe every single week, um, you know, looking into these things and giving you guys, you know, little, little hints that, hey, I'm getting in on this. Hey, I'm getting on this. But again, I'm still waiting for Bitcoin to make its move so I can have that 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 positive or more so, you know, good outlook that is going to go continue up. Um, there's just some things that we're waiting on. I'm being patient, but there is different airdrops that you guys can participate in. I'm still participating in airdrops. I'm still doing, you know, the XRP coins and XRP um, NFTs on the Zum wallet. I'm still doing all that stuff but I'm not specifically buying any crypto right now. So just be patient, you know, coming into the new year, especially around holidays, times get slow, but, you know, come the new year, we might see some new partnerships. We might see some new countries trying to adopt Bitcoin as a legal tender as El Salvador did, right? So with that understanding, guys, um, that's really all I have for the market. Let's just be patient. Let's sit on our hands. Let's react. Let's not guess. You know, you never know when the bottom's going to happen. You never know when the top's going to happen. But when these when these prices start going up, do not be afraid to take profit. All right. I'm going to say that again. Do not be afraid to take profit. Right. Because, yes, you can have, you know, two, three hundred percent gain. Be like, I don't know. I think it's going to continue up. Why? Why not take that profit? And even if it goes up another three, four hundred percent, you still made money, right? Scale, right? It's called scaling. Take out, you know, it goes up 100, 200 percent. Take out 50 percent. It goes up another 20 or, you know, another 100 percent. Take out another 25 percent. And then it will goes up another 100 percent. Take out all of it, right? Because it's not no cryptocurrency. I don't care who, what cryptocurrency, I don't care who told you it. No cryptocurrency is ever just going to go parabolic. It's never just going to go straight up. Right. It's going to be a retracement, and especially with altcoins like gaming cryptos, you're going to see 70 percent, 80 percent retracements after a three, four hundred percent gain. Right. So might as well capitalize on the two, three hundred percent. You know, even if you put one hundred dollars, you still make three, four hundred dollars profit 
why not take that and then go find another crypto that's getting ready to pop and maybe do the same thing, right? So with that understanding, we have some really good things that are coming up. New coins, um, Pat has a new drop for you guys. Um, I really don't have too, too much. I, I kind of went over everything um, coming into the new year. Um, like we said before, in the last session, we have Lion Legends, which is the NFT on the Cardano network. They're coming out with a, um, a coin here in the near future. Um, if you have both seasons, they're going to be giving you an airdrop for having the lion and the lioness. You're going to be able to technically mate them and have a baby for free that they're going to drop in your wallet. Um, Pavia, they're coming out with a new drop um, beginning of January into February. They're going to be coming out with, I think it's 30 more thousand or maybe 40 more thousand plots of land. So if you weren't able to get any plots of land yet, and maybe you're like, I don't really have that much right now. I'm telling you guys, you're going to want to get in on this drop because after this drop, there is no more land. There's a total of 100,000 plots of land. So they've already dropped 60,000. There's only 40,000 left. After that, there's no more, right? And this, like I told you before, Pavia, Pavia is probably going to be one of the biggest metaverses in the whole entire crypto game, at least in my opinion, until we see something else bigger. But right now, just looking compared to the central land and compared to sandbox, they're doing very similar things, right? But just now on the Cardano network, not the Ethereum network, right? So with that being said, guys, I want to pass this off to Pat. Um, again, I do appreciate you guys for being on here. Whenever you see this video, when we get it up on YouTube tomorrow morning or afternoon, I appreciate you guys for watching this. I appreciate you guys for sticking with us for the whole entire year. I know, you know, we've been you know, on and off with calls. We've been doing different calls. We've been doing different sessions, but, you know, you guys stuck with us and you guys are going to reap the benefits at the end of the day. So with that being said, appreciate you guys. Appreciate you, Pat, for, you know, what you do, man. Um, take it over. Let's get it. What's up, guys? Thanks, Jenna. Um, so, a couple things. First, like he said, airdrops. If you guys been watching us, you should be getting them every 10 seconds. So, we have a few we listed. Watch our last couple videos. If you are not getting airdrops, you are missing out. You will still qualify. You have to check out our last video. On that note, a reminder, if you were watching that last video, get your on the pulse chain. Go ahead and hit that faucet. You'll get your free token. Every single day you can do that. If you don't know what I'm talking about, when we get done with this show, go watch the last video on YouTube and you'll figure it out. All right. Free, free money. Coins coming at least for the next 90 days. All right. So keep up to date with this. This is one reason you want to stay with us on these shows. Um, all right. So that's one airdrop. I'm going to go over two um, different projects coming out. The one is going to be a little bit of everything. It's going to be game tokens, um, NFTs, everything. <clears throat> Other one is going to be strictly the NFT. So if you caught us on our last show at the very end, I started talking about um, Cardano project. It was the, the Boss Cat, Boss Cat Rocket Club. Um, well, they have their drop coming out. Their second drop is going to be on January 3rd. It's 4 p.m. Pacific. 7 p.m. Eastern. Um, <clears throat> this is a drop that uh, me personally, I'm going to go after. Boss Cats uh, we, is, is a project in the beginning. Honestly, we were both a little bit leery of. It just it grew almost too fast, um, which is usually a red flag. And so we kind of like we held off on the drop. Like we, we, we stuck to like our guns. We held off. They came out at 20 um, ADA. <laughs> right now, the floor is... I think like 180, 190 ADA. Their average sale price is like 360 ADA. And they've only been out for, I want to say less than two weeks. Um, so they were they were the cats. Uh, let me pull this up. So this is on their Discord. So the cats, the characters already came out. Now they're coming out with their rocket ships for these. So the rocket ships are going to come in in different parts. As you can see, it's a... Uh, like if I click on one, it's a th it looks like it's going to be a three-part system, the tank, the actual orbiter, and then the boosters. So the way they're working this is you're only going to be able to collect, uh, I think, one per wallet unless you were whitelisted. Didn't mean to click that. Um, unless you were whitelisted, you were only going to be able to get one of these. So this is where you're going to want to set up multiple wallets if uh, you do decide to go after a couple. Um to do that, I actually, we just released another video today on NAMI. So if you're used to using NAMI and you've never set up 
an extra wallet through there, check out the video. It's a real quick video, three, four minutes, um, kind of like Phantom. So another way just to set up a burner wallet or an additional wallet. One thing I have noticed um, with the Cardano wallet, especially with NAMI. So um, I was using Yoroi in the beginning for a lot. NAMI was way more user-friendly, started using that. Um, I went to purchase the NFT actually this week and it wouldn't allow me because I had too many in my wallet. So they max you out on NAMI. Um, so you have to move some of your NFTs or create a new one if you're going to use that as your like only account. Okay, so just a heads up. If you ever have issues once you to purchasing and you have too many, um, just recreate one. Go check out that video. It's a real simple, real easy way to do it. Multiple wallets. You can fund both. Um, and that'll also be for these drops that where it only limits you to one or two, maybe NFTs per wallet, you'll be able to go after multiple. Um, but this is coming out, like I said, on January 3rd, which I believe is Monday. Um, so we won't really have any other time to go over this one. I think these are coming out at 35 ADA. Uh, but like I said, the other ones have already almost 10 X in two weeks. I don't see why this wouldn't do the same thing. Uh, this project, they're making a limited amount of the rockets. There's going to be all different rarities like normal. Um, so one thing that you could have a chance to do is if you go after one of these and get one of like the super rare ones, um, you could possibly flip one of the rares and for the price of owning one of the rare parts, you might be able to like obtain an entire rocket ship uh, of a of more common. If you decide to hold with these, this, this project, um, I think is going to be worth holding. They're like topping out the charts right now. If you check all Cardano's charts, I mean, they're like, they're, they're surpassing Pavia in, uh, in volume. They're, they're surpassing Clay Nation. I mean, they're moving some stuff. People, this this project, I, we, I guess we were wrong in terms of, uh, I guess you're never wrong, like sticking to your guns, especially... If we would have got burnt, we would have hated it. Um, so we did miss out, like I said, on a little bit in the mint. But with mint, you don't even know if you're always going to get one. Um, but even now, like I said, I, I picked up when they were just under 100 ADA. And there's now the floor is up to almost, I've almost doubled up since then. Um, <clears throat> and their community is strong. The chat's always going in here on their, on their Discord. So that, like I said, that's the one drop I wanted to go over for that. I did touch base on that last show, but it was part that we didn't record. Um, that's why you want to be on for the entire show with these. Some things we do, some things we do not record. There's reasons for that. So yeah, right here, actually 35 to, to mint. I didn't see that. It's right in front of my face. Um, all right, but that is that for this one. Cardano project 35 set up multiple wallets. It's one per wallet. Um, but like I said, this is the hottest project on Cardano. That's why I'm going to go after this one. The next one I want to bring up is going to be called Sin City. The Mafia Metaverse. Okay, so this token, they're coming out. This is going to be a metaverse. It's going to be a game. Um, so we're going to have NFTs. We're going to have in-house tokens. Tokens are dropping in the next 10 days. Uh, that's one you, yeah, I would definitely recommend keeping my eyes on. I'm going to go over that uh, in a minute. So this project, uh, they've been in the works for a little bit now. If you check out one of the reasons things really is catching my eye. So like certain times with projects, like I said, you can like with this boss cats, we weren't sure about, they grew real fast. This project's huge. Um, and I'm not one bit worried about going after this project. And it's strictly because of their team. And like, also, they were backed with Blocktopia again. But more important is, like I said, their team. So if you check out their team on this game. So as you can see, this game is pretty neat. Um, but they have big players. So they have like, yeah, so this guy was, was one of the lead marketing for Tron for EA Sports um, right here. I think this guy was a VP over at Disney. Once again, with EA Sports, Tron. So anybody, Tron is a whole nother token you guys can get. The call for that's TRX. Um, I personally have some, but Tron has not been moving at all. But Tron is supposed to be like a whole nother form of like the internet, another world, uh, basically a, new, a decentralized internet. Um, so you could always check into that. But Tron has been around for a while. But like I said, once you're throwing in Disney, EA Sports, 
Um, there was a bunch of big names. If you check into here, they're backed with their advisor board. Um, is let me see where I don't know if you'll recognize all of these. Um, let me go. It's easier to scroll through on a regular site. Cause they also, if you, if you, if you're on like, cause like we said, we use Twitter as like our number one thing to um, figure out the research with these. And if you're on Twitter, some of the biggest Twitter names are um, who backed this. That's the other reason. Like you got the right here, synthetics founder of Terra, everything. Look, co-founder of coin market cap, co-founder of super farm KSI, um alex becker i mean he goes in real deep he's big they just have big big names and like a lot of these guys alex and they're not putting their names on bad projects like disney they're not going to be a, like there's just big names that this is a, and also blocktopia like i said the last one that came out like this was when we called out sidious that was our last huge huge call out their two tokens came out at 18 cents and the other one came out at 0 0.0018. Well, that 0 0.0018 is sitting at like a 10 cents right now. The other one's in the multiple dollars. Those things hit like a 30 to 50 X within the first 60 minutes when they came out. Now they are very hard to get on to come out. Um, they're going to be on, um, you can check Blocktopia out. It's going to be costly to get it on there. Your other options, if you're not in the U.S., they are going to be on a couple, um, I think, three other early access, like IDOs. Um, if you're in the U.S., you're not going to qualify for those. You might be able to get in with the Blocktopia one. Still trying to figure that out. And then the one that I know for certain you're going to be able to get uh, in for, I just don't know at what price point, is going to be Copper Launch. So we have been... Um, we have done a bunch of times, we've done some stuff with copper. If you're not familiar with it, we have a video on copper. Um, but copper launch is also like an er a way to get in early. And the way copper, when it comes out, they'll pick a price for that token. And same as like a normal market, the more interest it has, it's steadily going to go. So it's a little set of time limit. They might have uh, released this token for, say, three days on copper. And depending on how much that volume is, it's either just going to drop until that clock runs out or it'll stay or it'll climb. Um, a lot of times lately with the projects, they've been going downward. The last two that have been like grand slams, once they come out, they steadily go up. So copper's one, you'll definitely be able to get it on. I just don't know what price it's going to come out in comparison to getting it if you are able to get it on that initial offering. Um, but we will be able to get it on both. So this is going to be the next big thing I'm going to go after in terms of getting in with tokens. Um, so you got 95,000 followers. It's going to be a free game. And the other reason this one's cool is it's going to be like a free to start uh, once it gets rocking. And then it's also going to be a play to earn. They have NFT passes. Like, check this out. Their pass collection the floor price for one of these is 3.3 .3 Ethereum. <clears throat> so you're talking like $13,000 for one of these passes to play this. Then the volume, having almost a thousand Ethereum volume when you only have 400 items is very good. And if you notice it's 400 items and almost 400 owners. So it's not like one person controls anything with this game. Like this is, this is completely spread out. Um, so what we'll do is I'm going to post this as it gets closer. This token is going to come out um, on the 9th when it comes out on Copper Launch. Let me see where. And then it's going to come out on, I'm trying to find my, my timeline sheet on this. Um, actually, that's where it was. It was on their Discord. The 8th, 9th, and 10th. So it's going to be a three-day on there. So they're doing four IDOs on the 7th. <clears throat> so if you're outside of the U.S. or if you want to check into Blocktopia, you can go in through that way. Um, Blocktopia is just going to always be a lot more costly because you have to 
you have to stake a lot of tokens. Um, outside of that, they will be on, like I said, if you're in the US, you're not going to probably be able to qualify for them because there's going to be a vesting period. Um, copper, you will. So you won't be able to get them on the 7th if you're in the US. You can wait till the 8th. You will qualify. We just don't know what price point. I mean, there's always the chance you can get them cheaper on copper than you can on the come out. I've never seen it with a bit with like a very successful project. I haven't seen that yet, um, but I have seen that with some of the projects, especially while this market's in the bear market. So don't think like you're missing out, but copper doesn't guarantee us like the best price. It does give us that early access though before it hits the main exchanges. And with this kind of game, that, that's kind of important. So we will definitely keep you up to date, but this is going to be my, when these NFTs come out, I'm going to keep in on this. These tokens, I definitely want to keep in on. Um, but we're talking within the next like seven, eight days, all right? So this gives you time to get your fund ready. We have the NFT drop with Cardano on Monday. So you have that one at 7 p.m. Eastern. And then this one will be in about a week. So I will touch base on this with next week's shows um, in case they change anything, any more updates. If they give like the exact price coming out on copper, that kind of thing, I'll figure that out for you guys. Uh, but that's pretty much it. Cause I, like I said, I don't want to focus uh, and throw too much stuff at you. We've been doing a lot with the airdrops. I've probably had you set up about 20 wallets so far. Um, so we'll take a little break from that. So now you guys can just collect or you can catch up if you're a little bit behind. Like I said, there is still time. A lot of them have that had timestamps. You've missed out. But the IOTA drop, that's running for another 87 days. So if you're not staking, um, I would look into IOTA. Check out our video. You can get money for the next 87 days if you get in on that. Um, the false one I was just talking about at the beginning of the show, that's another one. Check out our videos. We've been giving airdrops left and right. Um, but these, these are the ones that are going to be a little bit costly, but the last token. So like, oh, the reason I was bringing up that Blocktopia is so big with this is if you check out the last time Blocktopia, they only allow when they do their, what's called their block pad. They've only, this is only their second release. Like they do their research before they allow release something in their name. And like I said, their first one. Within an hour, 30 to 50 X. It was instant. Well, this is their only pro. They were supposed to pause um, any projects being released on this until they did an update and released a new token. They were so interested in this one. They did not want to miss out that they're putting this in, like I said, in the next 10 days. They're going to be doing, um, they're going to add this in their ecosystem. So between having them going with it, some of the top Twitter people going with it, like VPs from, like I said, Disney, you have guys from EA. It's just some huge, huge names that whether the metaverse or whatever does well, you can already see with that the ticket, it's already like $13,000. I personally am going to go after these tokens. This is one I will go after. Um, and I'm expecting the same kind of returns as we saw with, uh, with Sidious and Senate. I mean, those things, like I said, they came out at, under a penny and they're over a penny. I mean, they're 30, 50 X's quick. So check these things out, do a little bit of research. Like I said, it's called Sin City, S-Y-N, not S-I-N. Um, Mint, that's what I'm trying, I haven't been able to figure out. I thought I saw that Mint was gonna be 20 cents. Um, but then they usually put it right in their Q&A and I can't find where I saw it at first. So I don't know if that was uh, just in a chat that I saw. But that's one thing. That's what I'm saying. And I'll find that out for sure before this thing goes off for you guys. Um, but figure either way, like the, the price on these shouldn't really matter um, as long as you're getting those returns. You know what I mean? So like whether a coin comes out at a penny or a dollar when you're getting in early, you're getting a 30 X. It makes no difference. The amount of money you're investing, as long as you're 30 Xing that number, it doesn't matter how much in quantity wise you're getting of a token. You know what I mean? As long as that, when you go to hit sell it and take your profits, it equals the same. That that's all that matters. But I believe it's going to be under a buck. I think it said 20 cents. It could come out cheaper than that. Um, 
but whatever price that they announce that it's going to come out on these initial ones, I can't guarantee it'll be that on copper. That's the only one I'm not sure of. The other four, they will come out at the same price. Um, and then once they hit exchanges, who the hell knows? That Because that will be, if I had to guess, if, if they're coming out 8th, ninth, and 10th on copper, probably on the 11th, they'll hit the exchanges. So we're talking less than two weeks. This would be a really good way to start off the year. <laughs> um, start off with a 20 to 50X. It's not a bad way. Plus, like I said, you're getting all those airdrops. So I will keep you up to date Tuesday. Don't miss Tuesday's show. I'll, I'll go a little bit more in depth in this. I'll find out. I'll go into their search, talk to some of their uh, – some of the mods and all and see exactly what everything is coming out at. If there's going to be a big price difference with copper, anything I can find out, I will get to you guys. Um, but keep your eyes on that. The other drop, like I said, I don't think that's um, the boss cats, the way they've been doing with their, their cats and the volume that they're having. I don't see why these rocket ships won't do the same thing.